Hey, what is going on everyone? This is Ari Views back with another video and today I will show you guys my top 10 must have free iPhone apps of 2019. I hope you guys enjoy the video. Let's get started with the first app. But first of all, don't forget to subscribe for more videos. Also, don't forget to turn on the notifications so you don't miss any of my new videos. So let's get started with the first app. The first app for the video is called Reverse Search. This one is pretty cool. So it allows you to upload a picture from your like media gallery and then it will search for images that are similar to that. So that's really, really useful. Like a feature like this is on Google. So if you use Google on your desktop, you will have a feature like this on the image section. So let's just import a, an image here from the gallery. You can do it, of course, from the camera as well, or you can paste it from the clipboard of your device. So let's just import a picture. So once I import a picture, this is the screen that I will see right here. Just click done and now it will upload the image and will search for images similar to that. Now it will search on Google. You have also Bing right there, but that's a premium feature. And as you can see right here, it will find images that are similar to this. It actually found the exact one that I uploaded. So that's really, really great. Anytime you wanna search for an image, you can do that using this free app. Object Removal Pro is a pretty cool free app that allows you to remove objects from your pictures. Now the best results will be on pictures that are like surfaces that are flat and you have an object there. It will give you the best results, but it works on other scenarios as well and it is really, really useful. So let's just load a picture here from the camera roll. So here I have a picture. I want to remove the basket from this picture. What I can do right here is just tap right there and it will show me the brush. I can change the size of the brush right there. And all I have to do is just select the image that the part of the image that I want to remove. There is a basket. You can see right there, it will show you kind of like a loop that shows you what you're selecting. And once I'm done, you can see it will process it and will remove the basket from the picture. You can see I got a really, really nice result right here. So a pretty cool free app, also very, very useful. The third app for the video is an app called Live Canvas. And what it does is that it turns your live pictures into videos GIF files or into pictures. So you have live pictures on your device and of course you cannot share them as a video. You can do that using this app. So all you gotta do is just open the app, tap the plus button to load a live picture from the camera roll. Once you have loaded your live picture from the camera roll, you can go ahead and simply tap on the share button right there and now it will allow you to save this as a video. Of course, you can also save it as a GIF file or as a picture if you want to. So just wait for the process to finish here and you will be able to save your live pictures as a video on the camera roll of your device. DuckDuckGo is a free web browser, which is a real private web browser. So anything you search here will be private and it won't save anything. So you can see right here, I can enter an address or just basically search for anything. So let's just search here for iReviews. So you can search anything you want on the internet and all that stuff and everything will be private. And what's the cool thing about this is that it also has some cool features like, for example, you see this like fire emoji right there. If I tap here, I can just go ahead, clear all tabs and data. Just like that, you can see it will burn everything. It will close the tabs that I just was looking at and will clear every data from those tabs. Also, it has a cool feature that it also has a dark mode. So if you just turn off this, it will give you this cool dark mode, which looks really, really cool. Gift Toolkit is a free app that allows you to create GIFs out of your pictures, your videos, or your live photos. It's very simple to use. All you gotta do is just go ahead and basically select the pictures that you want to use, and then you can go ahead and create a GIF file out of this. So just tap right there and you can play it here you can see I just chose some pictures there and you can also go ahead and set the frames here. You can go ahead and set the speed of the GIF file. So I'll just choose with this slider right there. You can compress it. You can of course add text as well. So you want to add text, you can do that 
right here just enter any text click done and you can add it right there and of course you can change the size of the text and all that stuff and then you can also go ahead and crop it and once you're done just tap right there and you can go ahead and save it on the camera roll of your device Memory Calculator is one of the most useful calculator apps that I have seen on the App Store. So the neat feature of this app is that it allows you to memorize numbers so you can use them later. So for example, I enter a number right here, let's just do that. I click on Memory 1 right there and now it will memorize that number. I can clear this so I can go ahead and add another number here. I just want to add the, that other number that I just saved to this one. All I got to do is tap the plus there and tap memory one and it will add that number. Now you can see it will do the math with that memorized number. Of course you have other spots right here so you can have up to four numbers memorized on this calculator and then just use them anywhere you need. So that's really really cool to have that feature on this free app. The next app for this video is called Luna. This is a VPN app that you can get for free from the App Store. This is actually one of the best free VPN apps that you can download on your device. So basically this is the home screen of the app. You want to connect to a VPN. All you got to do is just tap right there and it will automatically connect. If you go ahead and go lower right here, you can go ahead and change the region right here. So you can see like different regions to which you can connect. All you got to do is just tap on one of them and it will connect to that region that you want. And you also have here security. So you can see right here you have all these real time monitoring and all that stuff. So basically you have all the security stuff right here which will show you. And up here it shows you how many days you have been connected using this VPN and then you have all the data that it has saved on your device. Repost is an app that allows you to easily repost anything on Instagram. So all you gotta do is just go to the Instagram post that you want to repost and just copy its link. Once you open the app, it will show you right there the post if you have it copied on the clipboard. Now all you gotta do is just tap on it and you can go ahead and add an attribution mark right here. You can set the color and you can change the position of the attribution mark. You can also go ahead and copy the, cop the caption of the post that you want to repost. If, of course, if you don't want to do that, you want you want to add your own, you just go ahead and disable it. And once you tap on repost right here, you can see it will show you right here two options to send it to story or to your feed. You tap right there and you can go ahead and just click next. And basically from here, what you need to do is just go ahead, edit it any way you like, click share and you're good to go. You can go ahead and repost anything on Instagram using this free app. The next app for the video is called Just Timers. This app allows to set different timers. So once you open the app, all you gotta do is just tap the plus button right there. Now you have, I believe, two or three timers that you can set at the same time for free. If you wanna add more, you have to pay for it. So what you gotta do here is just set the timer, enter the name of the timer right there. And the cool feature is that it allows you to add it to Siri, which means that you don't even need to open the app to activate a timer. You can do that using Siri. So here's what you got to do. Just tap here to add it to Siri and you will need to record the phrase start timer one. And that's good. Just click done right there and the timer can be created right now. So all I got to do here is just go ahead, open Siri, start timer one. And as you can see right here, it has already started the timer using Siri. That's really, really great. This app also offers a pretty cool widget that you can add to the widgets panel and you can manage your timers from there. And last but not least is an educational app called Seek. So what this does is that it allows you to take a picture or load a picture from the camera roll of your device of a plant, of an insect or like an animal, anything you want. And it will actually identify that species for you and it will give you detailed information regarding that sp species. So what you gotta do is just take the picture or load the picture from the camera roll and then it will show you the screen right here. Just tap on view species right there and it will show you all about that like kind of like plant or animal anything that you have so you can see right here 
all the information regarding it and you can basically learn more for anything that you want this is a really really cool free app as i said an educational app which is really useful and lower here it will also show you like similar species so you can go ahead and explore more plants or animals from here so that is it for this video guys these are my top 10 free iphone apps of 2019 i hope you guys enjoyed the video go ahead and subscribe for more also don't forget to turn on the notifications so you don't miss any of my new videos thank you guys for watching i hope you enjoyed the apps go ahead and check out the pinned comment section i will leave there all the links to these apps thank you guys for watching i hope you enjoyed it and i'll see you on the next one